All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can do a meta refresh or a redirect page inside of your ClickFunnels account. It's, it's actually rather simple. So I've got a notepad here that I will give you with this video or I'll give you the link with this video. And all you need to basically do is grab this code from the notepad. Now, a couple things I want you to note, and I put it in the notes up here. This one represents the number of seconds until the page will redirect. And then this, of course, is the URL where you want your page to redirect to. Now, why would you want to redirect a page? Well, the cool thing with ClickFunnels, and I want to show you this, is under Settings, SEO, Meta, um, you'll see you can enter in a page title and a page description keywords, the author, but also a social image. Now your social image, and you can see a preview of ours down here, should be ultimately 600 by 312, or better yet, 1200 by 624. That's the, um, you know, the ultimate size for Facebook to show up. So these, when you put the URL for your ClickFunnels page on Facebook, Facebook is going to read the title, read the description, show this ultimately sized image, 600 by 312 or 1200 by 624, and it's going to make this image clickable. So this is kind of what it will, it will give you a preview of what it's going to look like on Facebook. Now, the great thing is, is if you're promoting an affiliate product, say from JVZoo, you can actually edit the HTML. Um, code here to reflect that JVZoo link and still be able to post to Facebook. Um, so it's really rather simple. So basically, I mean, we didn't have to add the standby and the gears and we're sending you to awesomeness. I'm actually going to give you this page as a share funnel so that you can have it with the images and whatnot because you could actually set your um, content redirect to zero and chances are they would barely see the page unless they're on a slow internet. I just thought this was kind of cool. Let me just show you a quick preview. Let me change this to, um, we've got it going to my resources page right here. You can see markcall.me forward slash resources. So let me click save and watch what happens when we preview. You're going to see the page for one second and then boom, it's going to redirect to wherever we told it to in that meta refresh. So it's pretty simple. Now, if we changed this, let's change this to uh, Facebook.com and I'll show you how that will work. So we'll change that. We'll go ahead and click save. We'll let the saves take place. And then if I click preview, You'll see, boom, they see this for just one second, and then they go to Facebook. So you can send them anywhere you want. Again, the advantage of doing a meta refresh, um, and let me just exit out of here and get the link for this and show you how it will show up on Facebook and why you'd want to do this. So if I go to Facebook, and I take that link and I just pop it in, and we'll give it a second, you'll see you can now pull the link out and it's going to keep your data here. It's going to keep your title, your description, and your image. And if I posted this, it would make the image clickable to wherever we told the meta refresh to go to. It's kind of cool. But the advantage, again, is sometimes you can't post a JVZoo link. Sometimes you can't post other affiliate links because um, Facebook blocks it. Now, using your ClickFunnels account, you can create a social image picture redirect, um, and it's kind of cool. I'll be doing trainings down the road on how to um, create these images right inside PowerPoint. It's very easy. Um, so if I go ahead and post this, and this is just a test, um, let me just click on the image, and you'll see, stand by, we're redirecting you. And we had it going to Facebook, but that could have been any place we wanted it to go. So it's that easy to create a meta refresh, a redirect page for social posting 
so that you can post your affiliate links or whatever you may want to do. So again, in the document that I'm going to give you a link to um, in the description of this video or wherever it might be, um, just check wherever this video is posted and I'll give you this actual Word doc. You can import my actual page right here just by logging into your ClickFunnels account and then dropping this URL into your browser window up here. If you don't have a ClickFunnels account, you can click on this and it will actually send you right to this funnel and you can go ahead and sign up for a free trial or actually get this funnel for like $19. So, all right, I hope that's helpful in how to create a meta refresh, a social redirect page for Facebook. Uh, we'll be posting many, many more videos and thanks for watching.